Hey everyone, it's me Sachita. Welcome back to the channel. I hope you all are doing absolutely fine. Today in this video, I'm going to talk about a platform which is called Mentimeter. Yes, this is the platform which you can use for your online class, for your tuition class, or maybe you are giving any presentation in your department or any seminar, or even in the uh, this one, the group meeting, the head of the department meeting, or maybe your subject meeting. You want to take the vote of your uh, teachers and you want to include some water voices so you can include all those things by using that platform as a teacher i'm using it for many purpose so i just thought to let to share with every one of you so that you can also use best part is this is a free platform and you can use it all the way like free of cost without even downloading you just go to the browser and you can use it so without any delay let's start today's video if you are new to the channel do consider subscribing and join in our community of teacher squad yes see we are growing we are on 24k and i uh, announce a giveaway also which is i think maybe released by the time i will add it this video so uh, do participate in that if it's not released yet and keep an eye on this i'm planning to do some workshop which is obviously free of cost for my teacher uh, community plus as the channel is growing i'll try to bring more ideas and do keep adding your questions whatever coming in your mind which is giving me a huge idea to make new videos and what all problems you guys are facing so without any delay let's start today's video so if i talk about mentimeter what you need to do uh, you need to go to the google a second you need to go to the google and you need to type mentimeter okay as soon as you type the mentimeter it will the first option which is coming interactive presentation software click here so i'm clicking on this now so once you come here you will see two options sign up and login so as like any other social platform you just fill your name your mail id and you can sign up so as i've done login so i'm doing the login i already have my old credential when as soon as you click press on login it will open you like this i will show you see like this for me it's showing my old presentations because i'm using it every day now for you it will show like this and these old presentations will not exist now you will uh, press on a uh, new presentation or on new folder these are the two things here new folder if you want to create a one folder for each class so it will be easy like this i have created for grade 10 advance here 10 advance 2 g3 g4 so these all the folder so it will be easy for if you are looking for a presentation which you have prepared for a particular class now i am going for the new presentation i'll write down the name for example i am doing for my uh, this one uh, class my uh, meeting so i am writing the meeting so this is the name i created the presentation okay as soon as you open this can you see this is a slide which is and these are the type here now what you need to do what type of question you want to ask your audience are you looking for some words for example you will say to your student what are acids and they will say one one words it will come in the word cloud then there are open ended question i will show you some examples so that you will get an idea of that one second for example you can take the this one how to do the uh, percentage of their disease in plus you can do such bar codes here and other than that if you will choose the word cloud it will come like this all the and this one uh, color uh, this one the words will come open ended questions or they can add any picture and you take their uh, vote for this so let's do them one by one i am taking first of all the cloud what will happen if i type i need to type the my question here i will type my question one second yeah so i'm typing what are acids okay 
so i type the question here now you need to choose how many entries you want from the participants and then you what you need to do as you prepare the question and the entries you need to go to and click on share as soon as you click on the share you will you can click the copy link here or you can show the barcode also here for example you are taking a presentation and you want to take the vote for the words from your team member so you can show the barcode on the screen and they can use their phone camera and do it same time and if you have students you can copy the link and provide them and they will enter their entry once they will enter i will show you how it will look like yeah so can you see this like this it will show if you will choose a word cloud so as soon as they will write anything these will pop out so you can ionic bond is ketan and anion it is the bond between they can write down their names and like that they will give their views so same way you can use many way the best part which i like the many kind of things the type of question see you can use the uh, you can download your results of the question plus you can choose a quiz heading or you can you you can use many to who will win this kind of question or the image or quick form so many things you can use here or the typing question you can use so many different types this is a just like a opening activity if you are starting a presentation you will take what you think about this thing right in your class also you can use or in the presentation also use believe me if you will use such kind of platform it will give a different type of impression in a presentation of you or maybe you are just doing a subject meeting of with your department you can use their vote uh, which type of test you want to conduct for student and you can uh, take the voting from this by using this one this will really create a professional environment and will add a feather in your cap the kind of presentation you give you deliver the lesson and definitely you can use in your class with your students also so i hope you really like this platform explore it more and let me know what are the different way you have used in your presentation or in your class that's all for today have a nice day bye bye